and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. Hello, hi, and welcome back if you're a returning subscriber. You are the best. I'm Katie, welcome if you are new. And if you are new and you enjoyed today's video, then please consider hitting that big red subscribe button in the corner or underneath the video. As 95% of you are not subscribed to my channel and it would be so nice if you know we saw each other again. So, it's very like loose fitting this, but it's very comfy anyway. Um, so today, as you probably have guessed from the title, I have finally been to Primark. And this is a Primark summer haul. It's kind of a short one for me. I'm normally more of a 30 minute kind of video kind of girl. So if you're ever a bit bored, then I've got plenty of long fashion hauls full of gorgeous things, you know, waiting to be watched. So definitely we're hitting um, that subscribe button full. But yeah, today I'm basically bringing you a Primark haul. So I actually had some bits to take back to Primark since before lockdown. Um, and in Wales, the ban has only just been lifted that we can actually go into the shops now. So I went to Primark, had a great time, took that stuff back and spent more money than I took back. So how often does that actually happen? If that's happened to you, click the thumbs up button right now because it just happens every, I even said to the woman, I was like, this happens every time. I come here to bring stuff back with no intention of buying anything else. And then I leave with more stuff than I brought back and I have to pay more. <laughs> but anyway, that's pre-mark, isn't it? Um, so the bits I've got to share with you today, obviously like some summer pieces, but just some like little normal pre-mark bits that we just love. Um, so let's just get straight into it really. So the first thing I'm gonna share with you is like basically they're like a dupe, aren't they, for Birkenstocks. Let's be honest, they're a fake Birkenstock. But I love being so I, was, I mean, I actually put a poll over on my Instagram. If you aren't following me on my Instagram, then please head over there. I'm at with love Katie as yeah, it's just worth you coming over for. That's it. I'm not even gonna give you a reason why. I am very active on there. Um, <laughs> so basically I put a poll over there um, asking you guys if you are a big and stock fan. And you know, they are kind of a hit and miss, I think. But I personally love them and I got into them funny enough from my mum, um, which doesn't, you know, necessarily mean they're super fashionable, but if you love something, you should wear it. And I love them, so I wore them to death last year. I had a black pair and I took them to Bali with me. I went traveling last year to Bali and I wore them to death on my scooter and I actually had to just like throw them in the bin by the end of it because yeah, I was there for three months and they were ruined. So I'm very happy that I've got a new pair at a fraction of the price. These were six pound. I got them in a size eight just because I have got quite big feet, but I'm a seven really, but I don't know what it is. Recently I just keep buying eights all the time and they fit better, so maybe I'm an eight. Um, yeah, I really like these. So obviously they've got a gold buckle, really simple, like just plain. And they did have these loads of colors. They also have like a copy of every variation of them. So they had like the one strap, they had the ones across and then just around the toe in white. And I think they had them in a nice like dusky pink and brown in the one strap. Um, but that's just in the one I went into. So I did actually go in looking for a different pair of sandals and they didn't have them in my size, which is annoying, but that's pretty much for you. Gonna go just get what you can. Um, so I'm really happy with these and at six pound, I mean, big and stuff's like 60 or 70 pound or 80 pound. So what a treat. The next thing I got is like a super pre-mark essential. Um, so I'm basically over time replacing all of my wardrobe hangers because to buy them all in one go, it probably wouldn't even cost that much. It probably wouldn't. But every time I go to pre-mark, I just pick up a new packet of them. These are, they say they're four pound, but they're always, whenever I pay for them, they're two pound 80 every time I pay for them. I may as well just actually just like go and replace them all. But yeah, I've just been doing it that way. So these are 10 hangers and they're non-slip hangers so things don't fall off of them. They're also just gorgeous. I use them a lot for filming when I'm talking about clothes. I will hold one of these up. And I just think it's a little bit nicer than a plain plastic black one or you know, whatever you can find that gets chucked in the wardrobe. Um, so yeah, I really like these. And as you can see, they're like pinky blushy nudie colors. Um, but I've also got ones for Reese that are in black as well. And I did get loads of like stuff for Reese, like basics for Reese. Um, so I've never really shared guys stuff on here, but if you ever like need some info for your boyfriends or anything, or if you'd be interested in something like a men's styling videos, I, I can style Reese up or we can film him and that could be really funny. So if anyone would be interested in that, leave me a comment down below and let me know because yeah, something we could do. Okay, so the next thing I got is this gorgeous sun hat. I've had my eyes 
on a few different sun hats um, for a while now. And I didn't, honestly, I, I thought it was someone who, I bought a sun hat last year. I just, I wore it once and I gave it to charity shop because I just didn't feel right in it. And if my hair wasn't in a high bun right now, I would try it on that. I don't, actually, I think, no, <laughs> it's too tall because of the bun. But you can kind of see the gist of it. I'll push it down a little bit. It's really pretty. I love the colour. And I think this kind of colour is going to be really versatile. I think this is just really simple because it's so simple and elegant. I think it makes it look a lot more expensive than it was. It was £4. I mean, like, how can they charge £4 for a hat that gorgeous? I don't even know. But I love it, and I think, yeah, like I said, it's a really cute colour. And I have been looking for one online, and I did actually find one from H&M, which I have got. Um, I don't know whether to show you guys, or maybe I'll save it. It's, I think I'll save it. You have to come over on my Instagram and see it over there, so tell us about that. At with love, Katie, two underscores. Okay, so next I picked up this gorgeous dress, and this has been inspired by, if you don't follow a brand called Vita Grace on Instagram, you are missing out, because I love, love, love their stuff. And when I have the financial funds to have my whole wardrobe of Vita Grace, I 100% will, because I personally love their brands. They're not even that expensive, it's just the fact that I love everything, that I can't choose one item. Although I do actually know one item is coming, which will be my first piece from them. For my birthday which is from Reese, which is lovely but it's not here yet so when it is i will share it with you guys but i'll leave them linked down for here um i'll leave actually sorry i'll leave their instagram down below because they're definitely worth checking out they're just a gorgeous fashion brand and i love them and basically there was this gorgeous white dress on there the other day and ever since i just wanted one and um, so i thought this was absolutely stunning it's a midi dress it's a size 12 now i've not tried this one on but i've tried another one on very similar which i'll share with you in a minute so I'm thinking it's actually quite tight because there's no stretch fit in it. I don't know, maybe going up a size for like a little bit of comfort may have been better. Um, I'm normally a size 12, so I'm not really sure. Pre-mark, you know, it is hit and miss. This was £18, which for pre-mark, like, it's kind of expensive pre-mark, but it's also an £18 for a whole dress. And I just think, I mean, this summer I've been doing so many hauls with so many dresses in, and I don't think I've seen any that were £18 that were this nice. So I'd be happy to pay this for this dress. I think it's gorgeous. Um, it's got like a rouge fit in at the waist, at the back, which is nice, nice and stretchy, give you a bit more space. And yeah, I just love the button details on this. It's kind of like milkmaidy style, just like very elegant, girly, chic, and then it's got this like broidery anglais style um, to it. I will, I will have to try it on. Luckily, it is double lined at the front, but the back isn't double lined, so you may see a bra through the back, but you may be able to get away with not wearing a bra at the front because it is double lined, I'm not sure, it also comes with a little spare button and it's just a really lovely length. Next I got another sun hat which actually in the store I like this a lot more than when I got it home. You know when you get things home you're like, I didn't like this colour in store and I wasn't sure about that colour in store but I preferred that one actually now I've got them home. This one's only £3 though, it's a lot bigger um, and again, excuse the bun on top of my head, I'll just push it down. But as you can see, actually on this is quite nice. Like, it's quite glam, it's quite bougie, it's quite big. You're going to look a bit extra, but it's definitely going to keep the sun off your face, which is actually the reason why I wanted a sun hat, which sounds so lame. I just want the sun to keep off my face. But basically, I've started to get some lines on my forehead, and I just don't want to age myself any quicker than I need to. So, yeah, basically, that's why I wanted a sun hat. But I also do think they look gorgeous. And I did wear one in one of my recent Instagram posts, um, which I actually borrowed from Reese's mum. Which is kind of what made me think I better go and buy myself one. Um, yeah, so I like the colour of this one, but I prefer the other one personally. Now my next buy is uh, just such a random pre-map purchase. There was a really cute one. There was a Mean Girls bottle that I really, really wanted because I'm obsessed with Mean Girls and I love it. And I've just started actually a feature over on my Instagram, which is hashtag on Wednesdays we wear pink. And basically I share anyone who has shared a picture with me of their pink outfits or pink dresses or basically anything that's pink that I love on a Wednesday. I'm going to share that every single Wednesday. So it's going to be basically a girly Wednesday every week. Um, I normally share a pink picture on Wednesday like in a pink dress or something like that but yeah basically that's started and there was a bottle that said on Wednesday to wear pink but it was a small one and I really really wanted one to know that I'm drinking enough water every day because especially in the summer like it's so hot I've been working out I work out most days, I'm going to say I work out every day, don't work out every day, but, um, so it's so important to drink water anyway, but especially when you're working out, especially when it's summertime, especially when it's hot, so this is 2.2 litres, 
And they say the average human should drink two liters of water a day, but definitely if you're working out, you only drink more. So 2.2 2 liters, I'm hoping. It doesn't actually look that big. Like when you look at it like that, I don't think that's not that much water, but it'd be really good to know how much I'm drinking every day. So obviously I've got the pink one. They do do one in black as well. And it was only six pounds. I think that's really, really reasonable. And it is BPA free, which obviously is good because that's basically like, that's the bad toxins in the plastic BPA, I think. So. Has anyone watched that Will Ferrell film yet with um, Rachel McAdams? Oh my god, absolutely. To start with, I was like, what am I watching? And then as it went on, I loved it. And I was crying my eyes out by the end. And now I haven't stopped playing the soundtracks. <laughs> since. Yeah, it's basically, if you've seen that, you'll know what I'm on about. If not, go and watch it. It's on Netflix. So the next item I've got to share with you guys is, like I said, inspired by that dress that I saw from Vita Grace. So this is a really gorgeous, um, like soft floral print. It's a pleated mini dress, is it mini? It comes it actually comes down to my knees and I'm quite tall. So it's kind of like just to the knee. But then what I like about this dress, it actually goes a little bit longer at the back. So it sort of scoops, not really long, just a little bit longer at the back, which I think is really, really lovely. It's got little puff sleeves, which are really cute. This is a 12, but this, I've got to say, it's a little bit tighter on the bust area. And I did have like a flat sports bra on as well. So it wasn't like I had a push-up bra or anything. Um, so I think if I, I'm going to try them both on and see which one I prefer. But having only tried this one on, I would say I would definitely go up a size in this one. So I would go to a size 14. I don't think it would affect the style of the dress at all. And I do think the, the frills on it are just gorgeous and the pattern I just I just love it I think it looks so much more expensive than it is this one is actually cheaper than the other one so it's only 15 I think it's super easy to wear in the day wear in the night you know all that shebang that I normally say you could dress it up with this you could dress it down with that and we know we can do that with a white dress but white dress is just my favorite they're just classic they never go out of style and you can have them forever so you can't go wrong with a white dress basically um, my favorite kind of classic style and that's actually it. Like, I, it is a short one for me today. So I hope that you did enjoy this video. And if you did, please remember to hit that thumbs up button. Hit that subscribe for some good vibes. Because why would you not? And if you are a subscriber and we've never spoken, I would love it if you could just leave me a comment and say hi. Just introduce yourself. Because I've found out recently some of my subscribers are from the coolest places in the world. Like I had someone from Brazil. Someone from Barbados. I was like, oh. Can I just come there, please? Because that's amazing. Um, where else? I've got like a few different people like that have re reached out recently, and they've all been from the coolest places. So yeah, I'd love to hear from where you are from. And if you don't know, I'm from Wales, which is in the UK, and that may be why I have a slight Welsh accent. Uh, yeah, but thank you so much for being here today. I really hope you did enjoy today's video. And I will hopefully see you in the next one. I upload videos Monday, Wednesday, and Sunday, and occasionally a few extras throughout the week so definitely worth subscribing for thank you so much for being here and like i said if you aren't following me over on instagram please head over there it's at with love katie and two underscores and all my outfits that i share over there you can shop on my like to know it page so thank you so much for being here see you next time <laughs>